Hey, hey, what's going on everybody? In this video, I'm going to be covering the two-step process in how to create an MP3 file using DaVinci Resolve. Steps you can take immediately to uh, get you effortlessly converting those files into MP3 using DaVinci Resolve 16 and 17. Okay. Now, I've come across this problem many times where I'm trying to upload a podcast, an audio file to a podcast, and it, uh, let's say, for example, the directory I'm using is Libsyn, and it needs an MP3 file, okay? And if it was an MP4 file, it would not accept it. So I found a way using only two steps. Okay, so here on my screen is DaVinci Resolve 17. I've uploaded a uh, video, okay? For example, what I wanna do is export, well, my end goal is to get an MP3 audio from it, okay? So what I'm gonna do is go to, let's say it's in cut, we're gonna go to deliver, and we just want to make sure a few things are set up correctly. So if you've been editing the timeline, if there's cuts, um, you may want to click, double click on this, or double check on this entire timeline, okay? Not in an outrange, you want entire timeline. Next, you want to click custom, you want to name it saying test, and then you want to, let's say, browse for location. Okay, let me just do hard drive, that's fine. And then render. Now what's important here is you, when it says video, audio in a file, on video, you wanna highlight video and then click export video off, okay? And then you want to go to audio and see where it says on. Uh, where well, there's a tick there. That's fine. Leave it ticked. Um, so here, QuickTime, it will generally export as either MOV. But what we're going to do is just going to click MP4, okay? And that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. And what we're going to do is click add to render queue. And then to the right, we've got job one, okay? Now, and it says test. Great, that's the right one. So we're gonna render. Okay, fairly quick. So it's saved. Now, what I want to do is head over to, this. that's the first step, okay? Just export it as MP4 because there is no option to export as an MP3. So what we're gonna do is go to Google on, this is our second step. Go to Google and we're gonna type in convert to MP3. Now, it comes up with a few websites that can convert it. I usually use online audio convert. So it, it works for me um, and it's fairly quick. So what we wanna do is just click on it and it'll say open file, great. Now we can open file and find should we test? Okay, so I found my file and it's 13 seconds long. So I wanna double click on step two, I wanna double click MP3. Quality, um, you can put it as best, but I don't put it as good, it's enough. And I don't wanna take up too much um, space in the podcast directory. So I'm gonna use that and then click, click convert. And then that's it, job done. You've now found a way to convert a audio file to MP3. If I open it and play it. The first thing a new entrepreneur needs to learn is how to control their mind. Because guess what? It's all on you. I hope I have solved the problem once and for all for you. Let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this video. Um, and if you haven't already, subscribe. Subscribe below and click the notification bell to receive much more content about video editing, online marketing and business resources and tips and tricks. Plus I'll be doing uh, some exclusive giveaways. Um, I won't go into detail now, but be sure to uh, subscribe and to check them out later on. That's it for me, peace.